So this is a very important question, extra question, uh, which comes often in exam. Prove that diagonal of a parallelogram divided into two congruent triangles. First and foremost thing is they have given us that there is a parallelogram. So let us draw a figure. that a diagonal, any diagonal like this, or the other diagonal, any one diagonal, divide into two congruent triangles. So A, B, C, D, given A, B, C, D is a parallelogram. Okay. And uh, we need to, to prove so if parallelogram is given, that means all the properties of a parallelogram are given. We need to prove that this triangle is congruent to this triangle. Triangle A, B, D is congruent to triangle C, B, D. Proof. In triangle ABD and triangle CBD. Can you tell me the first equal thing? Sir, um, the alternate angles are equal. Very good. So these two angles are equal. Angle 1 equals to angle 2. Angle 3 equals to angle 4. So as opposite sides are parallel, make sure you write this thing. And BD is a transversal. Therefore, angle one equals to angle two. Angle 3 equals to angle 4. Alternate interior angles. So there are other ways also. Okay. Tell me what else you have taken as equal. So the side. Which side? DB. DB, DB, common. Yes, sir. Common. DB equals to DB, common. Hence, these two triangles are congruent by which congruency criteria? So ASA. Very good. ABD is congruent to triangle C A B D. So which triangle we should take? C D B. Okay. Okay, sir. Angle, side, angle, congruency. And we needed to prove this. Hence, they are congruent. Done. Another way of doing the same question is sides also. Opposite sides are equal. This side is equal to this. And diagonal is common. Hence, by SSS criteria also, these two triangles can be congruent. If you do it that way, that is also correct. Any doubt? Okay. No, sir.